Yo, what's going on, guys? It's Houston Sports Talk picking in the video today. And today we're going to be again talking about the a potential reunion with the Houston Texans and DeAndre Hopkins. I talked about it right after DeAndre Hopkins got released, but today it was announced that DeAndre Hopkins wouldn't mind a or here's what it actually said it, it says that d hop is open to a texans reunion um and that's it that's all it says uh, d hop is open to a texans reunion and that he would be interested and in, well some other stuff i read not on bleacher report that he'd be interested in returning to houston and he really likes cj stroud's game so that is very interesting. We knew that Hopkins would potentially be interested in coming back here, but I didn't think it was going to be this series. Um, there are other teams that are in the play for D-Hop, such as the New England Patriots, the Cleveland Browns, us. I think the Chiefs are still a factor in D-Hop. Um, and then I would think that'd be it. I'm not sure. I'm trying to think. I, maybe the Giants make a play. Uh, for D-Hop, it seems like the teams like the Jets, Cowboys, and Bills are out on DeAndre Hopkins. So the Cowboys and Bills are two teams that were going to be interested in a trade for D-Hop, and those two teams are out. So, you know, I, I would be down for it as a Texans fan. I say go for it. I think the only thing I – only the only thing that concerns me is this, this filled wide receiver room. We already have a packed wide receiver core, and we already have a packed wide receiver core, and DeAndre's not even on this roster. There's already, right as of right now, the, here's what the wide receiver core is looking like. Robert Woods, John Mechie, not at no order of, you know, wide receiver one to wide receiver at this point, five or six. Nico Collins, top guy, wide receiver guys on the roster. Noah Brown, Nico Collins, Tank Dell, Xavier Hutchinson, John Mechie, Robert Woods. That is six wide receivers right there. Xavier Hutchinson, I think you kind of take him out of the table for the Houston Texans. If you sign D-Hop, I'm not saying he's going to cut or anything because I think Xavier Hutchinson has a lot of talent, but he wouldn't get any play time, play, playing time at all. Um, but... The wide receiver room is packed if DeAndre... It's already packed. It's even more packed if DeAndre Hopkins is coming to Houston. I don't even know what who, who the three starters would be. Hopkins would be number one. Who would be number two? I'm thinking number two would be either Robert Woods, Nico Collins, or John Mitchie. And then the three would be Tank Dell. And then the four would – I am so confused what, what the wide receiver lineup would be if D-Hop returned to Houston. I, I'm i guessing D-Hop would be wide receiver. I'm, I'm sure – I'm full. I'm fully 100% sure that D-Hop would be the number one wide receiver. I'm guessing then the number two would probably be John Mechie, the third. And then the wide receiver three for the Texans would probably be – I'm guessing again Robert Woods. So then the line the Texans wide receivers are D Hop, Robert Woods, and John Mechie. Then the fourth the fourth wide receiver for the Texans, uh the fourth starting wide receiver for the Texans is Tank Dell at number four. And then just just ranking the depth chart. Uh and then number five would be Noah Brown, and number six would be Nico Collins. I'm guessing, and then seven Xavier Hutchinson. Not that's not the list of you know best wide receivers on the roster. That's just I think how you know who the starters would be if D Hop returned to Houston. What I think it would what what it will be if he doesn't probably uh, Robert Woods, John Mechie, Robert Woods, John Mechie, and I think Rob, the starters the starters if D Hop doesn't come it will probably be Robert Woods, John Mechie. And Tank Dell, if and then and then the backup, the two backup wide receivers will be Noah Brown and Nico Collins, most likely for the Texans. If D Hop doesn't come, but if D Hop comes to the Texans, it makes the wide receiver group even more crowded. But at the same time, you have an elite wide receiver for your number two overall pick, CJ Stroud. I'm not saying any of these other guys are elite. I think Tank Dell has a lot of potential. And I also think if Tank Dell is going to be getting a lot of playing time, 
Tank Dell and DeAndre Hopkins is actually a really nasty wide receiver duo there. Uh, if if he's as good as he's looked in in OTAs and rookie minicamp, man, Tank Dell, D Hop, and and all the other wide other wide receivers, young guys and veter veterans like. They have other guys like vets like Noah Brown and Robert Woods and then young guys like John Mechie, um, Xavier Hutchinson, Nico Collins, and John and John Mechie. This is a strong young if D Hop comes back, this is a strong, nice, you know, wide receiver group. You have your veterans like Robert Woods and DeAndre Hop DeAndre Hopkins, and then those two vets are leading all the young guys and Tank Dell Hutchinson. John Mechie, and Nico Collins, and Noah Brown as well. He's pretty young. I think he's 25, 26 years old. So, and then on the other end, I think Woods is 29, D-Hop's 30. Um, so I, I would be down for it as a Texans fan, but, I mean, we have so many decent— no one on this roster, uh, wide receiver-wise, is better than DeAndre Hopkins. Maybe, hopefully, maybe one day Tank Dell can be as— maybe— hopefully i'm thinking he's gonna be that good and not as good as deandre hopkins but um you know be star potential potentially for the, for the texans but i don't think anybody's better right now than deandre hopkins but the depth the texans have a lot of wide receiver depth they have six wide receivers right now that can potentially have playing time um i don't think xavier hutchinson has a chance to start it all for the texans but if, if he does well someone misses a game he has a chance for playing time. So they already have six guys in the wide receiver room. Do they add, need to add in a seventh? I'd be down for it as a Texans fan, but it just doesn't make sense with six with already six wide receivers in the wide receiver room for us. But, you know, if, if this is the move we feel like we need to make, let's go for it. But you guys have your thoughts, uh, H-Town fans, and I'd be down for it, but I, it just doesn't make sense with all the other wide receivers in the wide receiver room. You guys have your thoughts. That's that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed and peace out. Go Texans.